So you mentioned trying to basically get to know as many as you can without being messy. Um, do you think there are a few cast members in here that just went above and beyond and are playing a, a super messy game? Um, yes. <laughs> Is that a question? Jigsaw. <laughs> I mean, this is this is the game. I mean, people try to work as much as they can with different people, and sometimes that bites you in the ass. I mean, it is what it is. Um, I try to limit as much as that and just really just work with like the people that I got good vibes from, so it doesn't look like I'm just hopping around to different folks. But at the end of the day, it's messy. It got real messy. It did get real messy. So I guess coming in, you said you saw the cast. Um, so I guess initially you didn't feel like you were super well aligned. How many people ballpark would you say you knew actually when you entered the game? I would say that I played with before that I have familiarity with probably like five, five or six. I think I'm being generous with the six. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're going to go in and, and I, I touched on this with Devin as well. Uh, those five or six, obviously I met you in the vampire diaries work. Obviously it's, it's pretty much done with here at this point. There was a vampire diary org at, uh, Alliance, um, at one point in the game. Um, what the hell was going on with that? Because I feel like people were leaving every other day. Um, I just couldn't understand and production was talking about it. Like, wait, did you see so-and-so left the group? What just happened? Did you see so-and-so just re entered <laughs> What happened? Are they working together? It's like, you guys were on this, uh, the same page for a while and then out of nowhere, something went wrong. Yeah. Um, I think even within that group, we had, and then when I say five or six, it's like five or six that I actually was like pretty close to. Um, even in that group, there seemed to be like alliances within the alliance. So sometimes when things happened that didn't align with the overall group, um, it was a situation. So it's kind of hard to navigate when you have people that you're familiar with and you want to like work together with them. But then they also have outside, you know, people that they're working with that doesn't necessarily align with your game. So no, I they, think a lot of the tension and a lot of the stuff that happened in that chat was really because of the fact that there were people that were working outside of that alliance with other people and it got messy when it came to voting time. It got messy when it came to the challenges. So and it showed because here you, you, you have yeah. to, your games out there. Uh, majority of the votes are public. Um, a lot of our competitions are, hey, knock someone out. So you were able to see where everyone kind of, where everyone's cards were. They were on the table, but yet you guys would still go meet and try and talk game. So I thought that was an alliance that was going to kind of go far. Were you guys honest with these outside connections that you had, or was this all behind the back kind of stuff? Um, I think there was a level of honesty that really we tried to do in this vampire chat initially, but as the game moved on and then we had the first few challenges where we were on like separate teams and stuff like that, then it's kind of like, okay, well now I have to make sure I try to save the other person that's not on the same team as me without me looking like, you know, I'm not helping my own team. So it was just kind of like, a really bad situation because I don't think any of us ex in expected um, so many of us to be on separate sides of the team. So you kind of had to like grow.